Hey, what's up everyone? I wanted to share these pictures. Some that I took and some that were submitted to the local news. This one in particular was submitted to the local news during the storms that we experienced a few days ago. They called this a shelf cloud. And you can see the individual who submitted it there. Now, the nickname for this, they called it a waterfall, a sky waterfall. And I had never, I had never heard of a sky waterfall in my entire life. I've never heard of that before. Have you ever heard of it? Because that in and of itself is a new term for me. A sky waterfall. So, a shelf cloud that forms a sky waterfall. Now, I've seen these types of shelf clouds before. I've seen these types of... I've seen these types of shelf clouds or wall clouds before, but I've never seen that other one. I captured these myself and wanted to share them. There's some very, very interesting sky phenomena taking place lately. But these are just some very nice clouds. Now, you can hear this energy. Buzzing from all the technology, all the lights, and everything around. You can hear that. Oddly enough, earlier when I was sitting in the Nissan, the dog was at one of the dogs were having a fit. Lucy was going crazy, and then I hear <laughs> like that. Three grunts, and I grab the phone and get ready to record. Nothing else happens. That was it. No more sounds. There were no more sounds after that. And I was sitting in there shortly before that happened. And I heard... Feng Shui. Feng Shui. Feng Shui. So it was uh, the word Feng Shui stated several times. And I was thinking, what? I mean, I've heard that before. I've heard the term Feng Shui. And I... I've heard that many times before. It is a uh, it is a term, a Chinese term in their spirituality of an energy like the energy of the room, the atmosphere, and the energy changing in the room. So, why would I have heard feng shui? That's a that's an interesting question. I don't really know why why I heard that. But this was the sun a few days ago. There's Simba. Let's see. That was a picture of the yard, but that was the neighbor's vehicle. The, one of the neighbor's vehicles in the uh, background. But this is uh, Simba in our yard. Looked like he was singing. Just I've had sunshine in the past look like that as well. But the most interesting cloud that I wanted to share for this video is that waterfall in the sky, as they call it, sky waterfall, out of Cannon County, Tennessee, by Dana Keel, this, this cloud here, submitted to News Channel 5. So, thank you for watching this video. An interesting perspective I've been sharing in, in uh, that I, well, that I had shared in one of my previous videos that Kelly, Meyer Alaska, Kelly Marie Alaska brought back, uh, brought back up, regarding alternate realities and timelines and all times being one being together and spirits that we experience like civil war spirits could be witnessing us and us witnessing them and we're the ghost to them and they're the ghost to us regarding timelines converging time periods converging and maybe they were actually seeing us back then and now we're seeing them now so that's one thought one interesting thought or maybe we're witnessing an alternate reality merging into our or kind of leaking it hours it could be one of those two who knows but another thing is uh, a story my mama was telling me earlier about how my pa didn't even like when they were installing the electrical lines and network phone network lines back when back in the 90s 80s and 90s and all of that when they were installing all of these things he did not like those electric poles he, the helicopters were going over installing the, and bringing in those uh, electric poles and building all of those uh, electric lines through there and he didn't like that at all he didn't like the energy from them he didn't like he uh, he, th he felt that it was very negative and uh, I agree with that one youtuber who stated that 
these cell towers that she doesn't really she doesn't like them we don't like them either the way the way things are I mean can't live without them anymore but um, well unless you live off the grid but it's just we have to have a micro cell tower still even with modern technology you have to have a micro cell tower to in the house using the internet in order to have signal with AT&T right here in this one spot is the dead spot and uh, every once in a while not always but every once in a while it is it's crazy but yeah he didn't like that when they installed, installed the electrical cables and the network cables well they installed more they expanded upon it and he didn't like that because it felt negative to him and it was like a negative energy so I completely understand it has effects on humans and you look everywhere and see these all these electrical cables it's like disaster but I'll talk later about all of that I just want to share these clouds have you ever seen a cloud like this I found that to be quite interesting I know it's the moisturizing and the moisture falling and then hot and hot and air, hot and cold air masses colliding together and creating this shelf cloud or wall cloud and that condensation coming down and, and rising as fog and it just looks but it makes it look really cool so give your thoughts much love and peace I'm out my links are below if you'd like to show your sport and uh, my email is, is below as well peace